This looks like a pretty cool map. I gotta admit, this is probably one of the best Slender Forge 2 maps ever. Because, like, this is literally the definition of a monster map. No. Okay, now, maybe not one of the best. It's a good map due to the fact that it's a mansion and that it's based off a monster map. Yeah, it's a good map. Due to the fact that it's, yeah, it's a Yeah, if you're being chased, where, I don't even know where I would go if I was being chased. Like, if I was being chased, I, don't, I wouldn't even know where to start. You know, where to go. What is this? It's kind of a... Uh, I'm pretty sure this... Oh, it's dog from Half-Life 2. This guy's pretty tough, I believe. Just, just roll. <laughs> Luigi's Mansion Game Boy. Just try to run, just run. You can find the boss. It finds you. Oh! If you hear that music, it means it's close by, so. That's. That, that, so it'll be great. Yeah, I think this is my favorite map, though. Oh! Wait, there's a roof? Wait, you can actually access the roof, I think. Makes sense. So, this place is like two, three stories. So. I just didn't think they'd give us access to the roof. No, you can't get to the roof. No, there's two stories though. Can you go inside? No. What? Oh, uh, go inside the If you guys go inside the uh, doghouse, you'll actually be chasing it. Yo, Tim, where are you, bro? Tim, where do we go? I'm confused. Where do we go? I'm confused. Uh, go to the log. Oh! <laughs> Yo, go, go, go! Okay, just camp here. I don't think the boss can actually. I don't think he can access. Wait, let's go back. Let's go back. Oh, okay, he's gone. He's gone to. Uh, Tim? You might wanna. Oh, run! Okay, I think we're good. Uh, I don't know. Are we good? I think we're good. Seriously? Again? Okay, I think this map is kind of uh, I think this map is kind of great. Use the back then. Oh, there goes Asian. Guys, where's the exit by the way? Where's the exit? Guys, where's spawn? I'm confused right now. Let's go. Yeah, where is spawn? I figure this map is too big. Remember where spawn is. Remember where spawn is. I don't know, I'm in a... I'm in a room. I'm dead. Guys, it was last known, I'm dead. Guys, where's the, uh, where's spawn? So confused right now. Guys, respawn. Smokey. Someone's got to respond. Ground floor. Got 20 seconds. I don't think I'm gonna be out of this alive. Let's go, boy. Let's go. Wait, isn't spawn the basement? Yeah, it's the basement. Okay, well, that's even harder to find. Guys, it was nice to you guys put up. Yeah, where is spawn? How do you guys find spawn? I couldn't even find spawn. Salvador? Says this map was made by Salvador. Yeah, where is this though? Um, Oh, this is on the bot. I think I was on the bot. I'm legit sure. I don't need to make sure. 
Okay, so I think I know where spawn is now. So. <laughs> Normally you spawn <laughs> at spawn spawn. Once that's really surprising, but um, I mean, so when you find all the when you recover all the keys, where do you go? The spawn on the second floor. Yeah, the second floor. Yeah. Um, what is the boss battle? Can someone tell me what the boss is? Guys, I'm pretty sure Mario is stuck inside this portrait, but uh, no, him. We should just. Oh, we got a key. Let's do this. Okay, let's go to now. This one. Front door in the foyer has opened. Oh, I think I know who this boss is. Isn't this the um, big smoke or something? Like that? Troll fight. That was a big smoke from uh, San Andreas. Wait, where do we go? Do we already escape? How did we? Wait, did we find all the keys that fast? Well, that was really fast. Oh come on, man! Yeah, yeah, how did how did Luigi even afford this giant mansion? Was that ever explained? I guess. I don't think that was ever explained. I just at some point he just was able to afford a mansion. That was pretty much no elaboration. Wait, did people die? No. I think people died. Let's do this. This is probably one of my favorite maps just of all time. Out of all the maps. Slender So Yeah, let's do this. Are we good? Yeah. Why is the night? Oh, I want to wait. That's better. Let's do it. Coming, Kelvin. Go, Kelvin. Coming. Don't worry, Kelvin. I got your back. I'll never let anything happen. Got you, Kelvin. Got you. Brothers and arms. Go. Got your back. Okay, we've got to move on to the next area, guys. Go. I would run. Look behind. If you look behind me, there might be a boss. Oh my god. Okay, we got to move. We got to move. I don't know where I'm being shot from, but I think I'm good. I, I'm gonna go. I'm gonna go. I'm gonna go to the area, which I believe is over here. Go. Go. I'm looking for that key card. Gotta, gotta move on to the next area. I'm gonna do that is get access to all the other area. Get that area's key card, so. Got it, got it. What do we do? Do we wait? What do we do? I'm confused. When the door supposed to be open? Is the door open or? Oh, it's open, guys. The exit's open. Ooh. Gotta move, gotta move. Do this.
Gotta move, guys. Let's go, let's go, let's go. Find that key code. Okay, move on to the next area. Let's go. We lost Kelvin. Sorry, Kelvin. Sorry, Kelvin. I'll be back. Gotta move, guys. We gotta move. Let's go. Lost Beedo. That's not good. Keep losing people. Come on, guys. We got this. Pretty sure this boss is coming up here. I'm gonna start dark. I'm already on my way to the exit. I don't know about the rest of you guys, but probably you guys have heard yelled. So. Go. Let's go Havoc. Let's just see you let's go. Okay. Watch out. Where did he go? What happened Havoc? Get that key card, get the hell out of here. I'm out of here, guys. Let's do it. Hey, Medic, calling here. Yeah, boy, managed to escape. You hear that, guys? Yeah, boy, managed to escape. Let's go. Gate open, and everything. Let's go, guys. That was easy. No. So, uh, do this. How you doing? How you doing? Nice to meet you. <laughs> Let's do this. That was easy, you gotta admit, that was pretty easy. I mean, I put out like I'm, the only time I encountered the boss was at the very end. That's why it was easy, but you know, you know therefore it was, uh, it was easy. So, got it, we got it. Uh, anyone know who or what this boss is? Guardian. Uh, hell guardian. Uh, the Guardian, yeah. Is he a hard boss? Oh, yeah. Okay, I'm just gonna push my PC, guys. Yeah, this boss is pretty generic. Is he a tough boss? Key bag. So is he an auto chaser? He's just the generic auto chaser. Right. He's an auto chaser, boss, right? Uh, I'm not sure. Well, we'll find out once we, uh, or once he confronts us. I got the key. Because I'm definitely not going to confront him. He's going to have to confront me. So, not really the move to see this guy. Okay, everyone once you once we achieve one card, move on to the next area. That's where the next card will most likely be. I think all of you guys know how to play this map. So This is like my favorite map of all time. So yeah, I just like the way it works. It's my favorite map. What the f What is that? I can't favorite map is gate free. I can't tell if it's chasing after me or not. But uh Dude, you can hear that thing across the map. Let's go, Smokey. Guys, move on to the next area. Let's go. As far as none of us died yet. Okay, this this music's getting kind of creepy. Not gonna lie. Yeah, what is that war? Like, you guys say this is a boring boss, but I'm just gonna listening to this boss and it seems kind of, it sounds kind of scary so I don't think this is really that boring but uh no 
Sounds kind of scary. <laughs> Sounds get really scary, so. Uh, I haven't even counted the boss yet, so. That's kind of good. Then again, there's a lot of us, so. The chances of spawning one of us is kind of low. Okay, make your way to the exit. Good job. Let's go. Welcome to Tilted Towers. What is Zodi doing? Solo squads. Every time when I played Fortnite back in the days, the best way for me to practice was going to solo squads. Like I would go Tilted Towers, solo squads. And that was like probably that was for me. That was personally the best way to practice. Solo squads. What? When I played Fortnite, I played on mobile. Most like most of the time, I played on mobile, and it, it was pretty epic. Actually, though, like I played every, pretty much every day on mobile. A lot of people were trashed. Dude, I had so many wins. I think I had like a hundred. I think I had like a hundred solo wins. I think I don't know, but everyone was on, on mobile was trash. I was pretty good then. I thought, like I was really good on mobile. Um, like uh, I wish I had some footage to show you guys, but. I was really good at mobile. Before. I was even better I than. I was pretty good at Pixel Gun 3D. I was even better than some people who played Nintendo Switch Fortnite. Like I was better than some, just some Nintendo Switch players. Who were so happy to friends. But uh, yeah, it was playing on mobile was pretty fun. The graphics were trash, but you know it was fun experience. Okay, guys, let's get the hell out of here. But yeah, Fortnite was. Fortnite was good, and then it just started, like, I don't know, it started, like, becoming more fun. Okay, just run, guys! Uh, you gotta keep going, you gotta, it's at the very end of the map, it's at the very end of the map, you gotta keep going straight. Just keep going, and you should find it. I don't know, it's kind of hard to explain where the, uh, where the map is. Okay, we did it. We got it, guys. So I feel bad for. I didn't even mean to kill you, but. I feel bad for these guys, cause uh, that was about to... it's about... these guys are about to get destroyed. So, uh... I got it. My guardian is actually pretty easy, boss. Not good. It's pretty easy. In my opinion, I think the scariest boss in Slender Fortress 2 has to be Chris Walker. Yeah, Chris Walker is a scary boss. I would say Traeger is more scary. Isn't Traeger that like naked guy who carries that chainsaw? Yeah, Traeger is like the half naked guy. Would... He's a half naked guy. The scariest guy, one has to be Tripophobia, but not the Tripophobia from this server, the, from Gloves, the, the updated one. Victoria. Yeah, I don't know, the scary boss is like the community. It depends on what community, like on this server, I personally like the community a lot more than. I mean, I hate global servers. Like, I'll be honest, I hate global servers. Like, I got, I got them, I got muted a long time ago when I was younger. I sent an appeal to get unmuted, they get, you know, the guy was like. Uh, my PO got denied, so that kind of sucks. All I wanted to do was get muted, because I was muted as a kid. So. Oh yeah, I, I had this. Hopefully they accept it. Permuted, yeah. I mean, nowadays people get stupid, but that's what I hate about today. You know, now society. Right. Anyways, yeah, my PO got denied, so uh, you know. No, I mean, even before that, the global servers were pretty trash and not pretty, like, you guys, you guys, you guys are aware that they made every single class equivalent, right? That each class doesn't have their own abilities, because each class are exactly the same. Which kind of sucks, I don't know why they do that, oh my gosh, we're dead. Okay, stun the boss guys! Okay, you guys can actually stun the boss. You just gotta hit the boss. You can stun. Him. Just gotta hit the boss. If you hit the boss, you can stun. So I would say that if you have to stun him in order to survive, just stun him. The door is 
I'm, I'm trying to recover right now. I'm low on health right now. Let's take some heavy damage. This boss isn't really that hard. Like, he'll shoot at you, but if you, if you, um, stun him and run away, you'll be fine. Never mind. Okay, well, don't try it. Okay, don't don't try because it's kind of risky. I would suggest you not try to stun them because uh, it's kind of risky. So try not to. <laughs> try not to stun. Them. I mean, I actually made. The thing is, I managed to stun one of them, but since there was two of them, I died. So. Uh, Oh my god. I stunned one, but then I ended up dying from the other one. Yeah. I mean, this boss was... Yeah, this boss was just annoyed. Honestly. Like, in real life, if someone... If there's two guys with uh, assault rifles, and they went, if they came up to you, then you would obviously oh. die, so... You know, like, in real life... No. GG. <laughs> Yo, I'm killing there. everyone! Let's go! <laughs> Do this, guys. Move out, move out. Uh, $1,700 we got the exit. Is that clear? Everyone, move out. Death's no longer paid. Also, if some of you guys find it annoying that your meal weapons are put in your face, I can offer a command that will actually make you play in first person. Like, it's like VR mode. I'll type the command in chat. It's this. If you type that in the... Uh, oh, yeah, I'm using it. If you type that in the console, your meal weapon won't be in your face. So. You'll be able to steal armor clear. Uh, how to revert that? Well, how to revert that command? You type zero instead of one. So type the same command but zero instead of one. But it's a good command. You know, it's a really good. Command. You can even see your feet and your leg. If you look down while you're using the command, you can see your chest, and your your feet, your legs. It's an awesome command. It really makes you feel like you're playing in VR, like in first person. So. Oh, by the way, it is uh the boss is set by the way. So. The boss is um, like I, I don't know how to. I mean, he's um, an anime character, I believe. Just try to avoid, try to avoid him. Just r run away. If you see the boss, run away. I really can't offer any more advice other than that. But uh, just try to run away. Uh, he might have long reach. I think he does. He's big, so I'm assuming. Probably. But. All I can off all I can suggest is running away from see him. Because I'm not too sure how to avoid this boss. I mean with most bosses, running away is a valid option in order to survive and escape him, so uh, I would definitely recommend running away. Yep, running away is always a So guys, just so you know the uh, this music that's playing in the uh, in this video is is not music that I'm playing, this music does not belong to me. And this music is not being played. Really. This music is uh, part of the part of the game. So, run, just keep that in mind. Just keep that in mind. So, this music is not being played by me. It's not belonging to me. This music is only playing because of the boss. That being said, let's continue. Let's go, Wilbur. My man, Wilbur. How are you doing, Wilbur? You good? I got you, Wilbur. I got you. Guys, roll together, let's go. Okay, I think we're all here for mud. Wilbur, Smokey, T. Yeah, we're all here, guys. Anyone else that's not among us, or who's not with us, make your way to the end of the battle.
Also, just another quick tip that will definitely help you guys out is that if you go to options at the main menu screen, you go to bright. If you go to brightness, uh, you, if you go to brightness and you change your brightness and set it to the very highest, you want to really need to use your flash later on, on these servers. So, if you go to options. If you change your your brightness to the uh, to the highest, well. You want to need a flashlight. Flashlight's just gonna be on this server, though. I would definitely suggest doing that. That's what I did. And honestly, I don't even need a flashlight to look for that. It's awesome. Let's go to your. Uh, let's go to options. Go to brightness. Set it to the highest, and there. And that way, you want to have to use a flashlight. And honestly, actually, might. My default flashlight, the one I have attached to my shirt, that are, that we have, you know, in this in the server we have we have two types of flashlights. We have our default, we have our small one, and we have our big one. In my opinion, with the settings that I actually altered, my small flashlight is way more effective than my no my uh, my flashlight, my primary flashlight. It's awesome. Gotta gotta think outside the box. <laughs> let's do this. I'm not sure what the boss will be, but let's find out. Find a key you card to access the door. Your access, guys. Uh, I don't know what I can offer to help you guys, but if you see this boss, just run. It or just run. It might be you might be able to stun it as well. So uh, if you want to risk trying, then go ahead. But uh, if you see the boss, just run away. <laughs> it's a I don't. Let's do this. Do I stay uh, a lot? Do I say uh, a lot? I might I might say it a lot. I don't know. Ah, that's fine. Smokey, that's your fine. arms are uh, are smokey. <laughs> but you you got me thinking there was there was a beheaded kamikaze following me. Can't tell the I can't tell whether that was a compliment or an so <laughs> I think that was a compliment. Faster than you. Do you guys want to start like a Discord uh a Discord channel just with all of us? It'd be fun. I mean, this is the official Discord, the uh, Slender Fortress um, Discord, but you know it'd be cool if we just. Had all of us in it because we're using people up most. We're using people up on the server. Sure, I guess. I just need to convince kind of Odie to join. Someone's gonna have to make it. Anyways. I can make. If someone else wants to make. It. It'd just be cool, you know, because uh, I would run. You know, it'd be nice if we had a Discord with all of us, because, you know, if any of us want to play, then, if any of us, if any of us, you know, were to play, then we can just notify all, notify all of us, you know? <coughs> or if any of us were ever to play, then we could just notify all of us, so we could all go play. So, it'd be nice, you know, we could talk about di the different types of bosses, and, you know, inform each other, and help each other. It'd be cool. For now, let's try to focus on, uh, let's try to focus on winning this, shall we? Sure. I'm just really glad I'm Medic. In my opinion, Medic is one of the, you know, best classes to use for Slender Fortress 2. You know, the fact that I can actually heal myself is good. Uh, like I told you guys, um, remember when I told you guys that I 
Oh, turn my brightness to the very highest, so that now I can see that well, I can see a lot more further. It's it's awesome. Cause, you know, now I don't really need, really need to use my flashlight. Now I can see, I can see my surroundings from a really far distance. And I'm able to see a lot more than I would without. Turning my oh, without have turning my brightness all the way to the Anyways, range. uh, yeah, it's definitely that definitely useful. Nice. I would definitely suggest turning your brightness to the very highest, so that you won't even have to use your flashlight. So, it's awesome. If you turn the brightness to the very highest, you'll be able to see more than you ever would with your flashlight. So. Like I can see my surroundings extremely well. It's awesome. Anyways, I'm about to pick this up. Is everyone ready? Just only What's hit this one on ready. Then? Don't pick up the key card until we're all ready. Okay, are we all ready, guys? Uh, okay. All right, guys, are we ready? Just come to him. I'm yelling medic. Come to a medico. Yeah, we, we're, we're yelling medic. Okay, you scare me, uh, Adi. I thought you were a Draxus. Okay, uh, guys, guys, go. <laughs> no. Yo, we lost havoc. And Audi, I'm sorry guys. So I feel like that was my fault, but I'm not entirely too sure. No. I was just trying to be trying to be helpful while waiting for the rest of the people. So I was trying to be helpful! Goodbye, boys. Okay, I'm gonna try to dig this guy. If you guys go to if you guys go to SL go if you tap you guys go to spectate mode, you'll see how epic I'm playing right now. I'm go I think I'm gonna die, I'm not even gonna win this actually. I'm not even gonna win this. <clears throat> oh, that was, that was good, that was good. Wow, that was awesome. I made it. I mean, I don't know if anyone else is gonna make it. I don't know whether anyone else is gonna make it, but I feel pretty good. Wait, Tim? Yo, Tim! My man! Yo, Tim made it, let's go Tim. Nice to see him. <laughs> you know what I just realized? I just realized something. <laughs> I just realized something. Imagine if you were to use the Konku and the Black Box. You'd be invincible. Like, you'd literally be invincible. I don't know what this bonus run is, but uh, we'll just proceed as if it was a normal run. Ah, uh, GG. <laughs> GG. Guys, I'm feeling pretty scared right now. I don't know what this boss is or who this boss is, but uh, who is? I think I've, I've heard this intro sound, just this chase theme song before, but I forget who this boss is. I just I can't seem to remember the bosses. I can't seem to memorize them. So, um, oh, I know. Yeah, it's a ghost. Yeah, I recognize this boss now. This boss isn't really that hard. You can actually lose him easily. It's, it's a ghost boss. Yeah. He's like a floating, skinny ghost. No. Yeah. Is this the mother one? I don't think so. It's... Is it? I don't know. Okay, well, we already got a proxy. It's gonna come after us, so... Watch out. Yeah, this boss is... Yeah, this boss really isn't that hard. Well, I guess he's like, okay. You know, not that hard. Okay. The second I'd say his name, start chasing after me, so... Uh, oh. Oh, no, guys! Yo, <laughs> Yo, we lost the man, guys, watch out! So oh my freaking gosh, that scared the crap out of me. That scared the little crap out of me. Oh yeah, my calling. gosh, that scared me. Okay, let's see our contestants that are remaining in the map. Beedo, who's proceeding throughout the map, is 
feel, looking pretty confident. I'm watching you beat him. Look pretty confident. I see you proceeding through the map. He looks kind of scared, but also pretty confident. Let's go to Day. Day is looking pretty confident at the moment. He's wearing that flash mask, and now he's currently being chased by the uh, by the boss. Uh, what boss? What boss is this? Okay, this boss just seems kind of scary. Not gonna lie, I think this boss is one of the hardest bosses in the entire game. Yeah, what boss is this? Let's find out, bro. <laughs> you make it sound so creepy. It's like, let's find out, bro. But seriously, I'm kind of wasted. I, I like. I prefer to some story right now. Guys, I'm kind of, kind of concerned. I got a couple concerns right now, but maybe they should just wait. Oh my! Oh, what the is. freak is, dude? They're dogs. They're little dogs. Not even yeah, gonna lie, they're dogs. Kill dogs. Can we kill? Them? Okay, I'm gonna try killing them, since I'm a medic. Scout, I got you. Yeah, come to me, Scout. Come here, come here. Come. I got. Him. <clears throat> got one. Let's go. Kill it. Yo, we got him. Got it. Nice. Another one. Let's go. Go. Yo, Tim, you should have used the power jacks so. though. Oh, okay, now we got the real boss. Now we got the real boss who's after me. So there's the dogs, and then there's the actual boss who's after me. So he's after me, guys. Kind of concerned. I'm actually gonna glad no, I'm. He's, not. he's after me. What the fuck? Yeah, Tim, you should have used the power jacks so you can actually recover 20 yeah, health. Motherfuckers, fucking fast as fuck. Tim, if you Tim, if you had the power jack, you could receive 20 health for every time you kill a dog, which actually will be pretty useful in this situation. But you don't have it. Oh, I see. You know, it would have been, would have been useful to have in this situation. But it's fine. Yeah, I kind of wish I could see the game as well. But I don't know. Probably some weapon. Uh, okay. The boss is camping the exit, and now he's out there. Can we? Is the boss stunnable? By the way, is this boss stunnable? I don't know, I'm kinda concerned now, like yeah, I said. Probably. He may be, but like... <laughs> Yo, Scott, I would run. Okay, we got a dog. We got a dog. We got, uh... Dake, I would run. Okay. How many hits does it take to stun a boss, by the way? Uh, run. Oh, 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 Guys, run! Oh, we got a dog, so I'm gonna take out the dog. I'll do it. Go. What the dog doing? Oh, we got the boss right behind us, guys. I'm, I'm out of speed right now. I'm out of speed. I'm kind of concerned right now. Yeah. I'm gonna hide. I'm gonna try hiding. Because I'm kind of. Okay, I need to. I need to recover. How fast this man is! I need to recover my speed because I'm currently out of speed right now. Oh, we got day. Okay, if I'm gonna have to try to stun this boss when I really need to, I'm not gonna try to unless I actually do. So, uh, yo, day. Oh, I see your dead body on the ground, man. Sorry, man. Oh, uh, of course he's camping the exit. Guys, I'm gonna run. Oh, <gasps> uh, Dave, right behind you. Oh my gosh, I'm dead. Thanks. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> hey, I didn't know you were coming near me. I had no idea where you were. Was <laughs> I, I, I warned you, so. <laughs> oh that was god. that was kind of scary. This is going to be it for today, guys. Hope you guys enjoyed. Without further ado, see you guys in the next one. Bye bye.